Lesson nine, we're going to be finding an unknown angle value. Go ahead and rate yourself before you begin. And let's do some definitions first. Complementary angles are two or more angles and they add up to 90 degrees. So an example here is we have a complementary angle. We have 40 degrees and 50 degrees and together they make a right angle. A supplementary angle is two or more angles that add up to 180 degrees. So this blue angle and this pink angle add up together and you get a total of 180 degrees. So let's find the value of x. Now we know that this angle is complementary because they give us the right angle symbol here, right? So I know the total degrees is 90, right? So if my total is 90 degrees, I know that 60 degrees plus this x, right, this variable, would give me a total of 90. So I have to think to myself, 60 plus what would get me 90, okay? So, well, I know that 60 plus 30 is equal to 90. Another way you could do it is you could take 60 and take that away from 90 to get the missing value of 30. So x is equal to 30 degrees. Pretty easy peasy, huh? All right, now let's look at this one. We have angle BAC, so here's B, I'll start there, up to A, and then over to C. So this is my missing angle right here. Now this is a rectangle, so I know all of my vertices are right angles, right? A right angle is 90 degrees. So this total angle is 90 degrees, yes? Well, if this is 90 degrees, if I take away this part, which is 31, I have 90, subtract 31 to get the missing value. You've got to regroup, three from eight is five. So this missing angle right here is 59 degrees. All right, let's find the value of x here. Now I know that this is a supplementary angle because it's 180 degrees, it's a straight angle. So I have 130 plus x is a total of 180 degrees. So 180 equals 130 plus the value of x. So I have to say to myself, 130 plus what equals 180, okay? Well, I know that 130 plus 50 is 180. I could also subtract to figure that out, right? Zero from zero is zero, three from eight is five, one from one is zero. So this x has to be 50 degrees, okay? Oh, I went the wrong way. Let's try this one. Again, we have another supplementary angle. So my total will be 180 degrees, right? I have 130 plus, let's make this a variable. Let's make this um, u. Let's make the red portion u. So 130 plus u is equal to 180. Well, 130 plus 50 is 180. 50 would go right here. So u is equal to 50 degrees. All right, now I'm to find TSU. So here's T, here's S, and here's U. So the angle I'm to find is right here. It's telling me that the total, the entire angle amount right here is 86 degrees. I already have one part of that, which is 44. I will take 86, subtract 44 to find the missing amount. So T S U, angle T S U equals 42 degrees. Pretty easy peasy. Next, it's telling me the total is 100 degrees. Find A, B, C. So here's A, here's B, here's C. So the missing portion is right here, all right? So I know the total is 100. The part I have is 37 degrees. I know it's a little blurry, so I wrote over it. So 100 minus 37 would give me this missing piece. I need to regroup. So we have 63 degrees. So angle A, B, C is equal to 63 degrees. 
All right. Let's find G H J. So G H J is the missing portion. It's right here. It's telling me that the total is 120 degrees. So I have 120 degrees total, right? I know that this part is 90. So I'm going to subtract to find angle G H J. So I'm going to have to probably regroup because I can't take two from nine. Nine from 12 is three. So this missing angle, G H J, is equal to 30 degrees. All right, I'll put my angle sign there. And let's do one more. So find the value of um, A, B, C. A, B, C. Well, A, B, C is equal to 50. So I think I probably meant to do A, B, D there. So A, B, D is what is missing. So right there. I know the total is 50 degrees. If I take away what I already have, I have 20 degrees. So angle A, B, C is equal to 20 degrees. All right, let's go on the wrong way. Look at your homework. Woo, there we go. So what I would like you to do is I want you to find three different ways you can decompose 90 degrees. All right, so what are three different ways you can break up 90 degrees? I want you to sketch these three examples. Find three different ways you can decompose 180 degrees, and I want to see those. And last question, Kyle has two angles that equal an acute angle when added together. What could his angles be? Go ahead and rate yourself, and I will see you tomorrow.